what is google sheets mainly used for answer is making separate sheets what type of data can you store in google sheet cells answer all of the above what is the intersection of a row and a column in a google separate sheet called answer cell what feature in google separate sheet help you quickly sum up a range of numbers answer auto sum which tool in google separate sheet helps you filter and sort data easily answer sort and filter how can you freeze rows or columns in google separate sheet answer all of the above what does the function count semicolon do in google sheets answer counts the number of cell in a range chapter test what is an of a row and a column in google separate sheet called answer is cell how can you open an exciting google sheet answer is clicking on it from your google drive question 3 what does the function count semicolon do in google sheet answer counts the number of cell in a range question 4 Which tool in Google Separate Sheet help you filter and sort data easily? Answer: Sort and filter. Question five: What is Google Sheets mainly used for? Answer: Making separate sheets. Question six: How can you give your blank document command? a title in google docs answer by clicking on the document name at the top of the page and typing a new title question 7 how can you change the page setting of a google doc document answer page setup option in the file menu question 8 Which alignment option in Google Docs aligns text to both the left and right margin creating a neat appearance on both sides Answer justify Which menu in Google Docs allows you to access formatting option such as font style size and color answer format which menu option in google docs allow you to adjust the margin font and line spacing on the blank document answer is format question how can you give your blank document a title in google docs answer by clicking on the document name at the top of the page and typing a new title what is the keyboard shortcut to create a new blank google docs document right answer is control plus n how can you add page numbers to a blank google docs answer is by accessing the insert menu and selecting page numbers question 6 which menu in google docs allows you to access formatting option such as font style size and color answer is format question what is the shortcut key to bold structured text 
in Google Docs? Answer is Control plus B. Question Which alignment option in Google Docs aligns text to both the left and right margin, creating a neat appearance on both sides? Answer is Justify. How can you change the in how can you change the indentation of the paragraph in Google Docs? Answer is 